Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another edition of Hacks in Action. I'm your host, Rick Grimes. Today, we have another clip of Dov PS. Unfortunately. Everybody was like, you know, I saw some of the comments before I deactivated it. It got really nasty in there. Um, I'm going to deactivate comments because I really don't care to read them. I don't really care to hear the negativity. If you were going to post something positive, I apologize. But... I don't need to be reading that stuff. No one needs to be seeing that stuff. It's just all trash talking by people who either have agendas or, you know, it's whatever. Uh, it's not important. Those that say the things that they say are, are not important people in this world. So let's let's just ignore them and uh, stick to positivity, uh, which is what I do. I want to start off by saying before we get into this clip that this is the disclaimer that I'm going to be putting on all my videos. I do not monetize my videos. This is not for financial gain. This is just purely for the community. I don't need fame. I'm not asking you to sub. I don't. I mean, if you want to sub, go ahead. Um, but I'm not asking you to. It's not, you know, like I said, this is not for financial gain. This is just if you want to see the videos, just go ahead and sub. But if you don't, I don't. Just watch the videos. Um, you know, if you get, you know, linked to it or something, that's fine too. Everything is fine because this is for the community. And that's what I do. I serve the community. I love this game. I've been in this game since day one, since you had to unpackage your bandages in the lobby. If any of you are OGs like me, you'll remember that day. Um, you know, when you had to unpackage your bandages in the lobby back in the Z1, you know, um, starting lobby. It's just, people say I'm trying to ruin careers or um, I'm going after pros because I'm garbage. This has nothing to do with it. What I'm trying to do is emancipate or liberate, if you will, the legit players of the game who want a fair chance at playing this game. Maybe they're not playing to be pros. Maybe they're not playing to be on a pro team. Maybe they just want to play to enjoy their afternoon or weekend. But they don't want to be cheated out of their time because everybody's time is money. So that's what I do, guys. This has nothing to do with popularity or fame. I could care less. Am I good at the game? Who cares if I'm bad, if I'm trash, if whatever you think I am doesn't matter this does not affect what you're going to see so without further ado let's get into the clip boys and girls here's the oops i gotta rewind it here we go now when we first get into this i want to let you know that the kills are easy i mean anybody who is um got a couple hundred hours east and i mean the kill the guys that they were shooting at were pretty pretty bad they looked like they were new um, so disregard that, but I, I will show you what to look for. This is the first engagement. We have one guy here and one guy here. Okay. Now with, um, a low field of view aimbot, such as what the FPS is running here. You have an imaginary circle you can't see, but he can see it on his screen. Um, he can even, even turn it off so he doesn't see it, so he doesn't have any, like, visual cues on his screen if somebody was looking from behind him. He can turn off all the ESP. He can turn it off so nobody would see his sheet being even activated, um, it, you know, if somebody was standing behind him. It's possible. So, um... We'll go with that premise that it's possible that nobody could see it, but if he has it on the screen, this is from 10 months ago. Uh, you can't see it. It's off screen in the corner. It says Duos NA West. We don't have an NA West anymore, so you can tell it's an older clip. I put the link description, the original link in the description below. Go ahead and look at the original clip so you know I haven't doctored anything or altered anything or haven't done anything different than what you're going to see here, okay? So let's go into this, okay? So watch as he's going here. This is an ADS, and you'll see it kind of like stutter, like it was going to go this way, and then it was... This guy took off to the wall, giving it a greater distance from the reticle to the player, which means that the closest player was the guy to the right, and the program says, closest player, go to this player. Okay, just so you know, that's how the cheat works. Didn't see this. Oh, here we go. Anybody see this 90 degree angle? Does this look legit to you? Anybody ever shoot like this? Anybody ever do a, uh, a 90 degree I mean, that's a, if you drew that with, with a compass or a, a, a right angle, it would be a perfect 90 degree turn, right? It would be perfect. That's, that's uncanny. That's absolutely mechanical. That's not even remotely human. Your hand doesn't work in 90 degree angles. Your hand works, it, it, when your hand goes across the screen, you'll notice that the, my mouse curves, right? Because that's the hinge of your wrist. It curves. 
nothing nothing on your body goes eh, 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 eh. like like it, it, you could draw like this angle here on this bar right here see this bar right here or 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 shit this you know this uh from here straight down the here straight pick any right angle that you can find I mean, it's perfect. You can't even miss it. And after he kills this guy, after he kills this guy, it does a straight line. Whoosh, stops. Doesn't he, see how my my cursor went past his head? Whoosh, and I'm running on 400 DPI. That's you know, it's not it's not a whole lot um, of DPI, right? Natural. I mean, natural. On this kind of movement, it's totally. Oh, just watch. I mean, that's not even remotely human. So you not only do you have a 90 degree turn, but you have That's pretty robotic. And then you got one over here. See how it stops and goes straight over. Stops, straight over. Stops, straight over. What you just saw there, people are going to be like, oh, I've gotten two taps in cars before. But yeah, so have I. Not with two bullets fired with a, a gap in between it. Cheaters do this. I've seen this like probably about a million times from cheaters. And he's got a 39 sub 40 MS ping, so the shots are crisp. He's not going to get Narnia shots, right? I mean, that's a pretty decent connection to a server. Um, but let me explain how um, shot compensation works for a cheat. Now, let's go back a little bit here. I need an example to look at. Okay, so we'll use this car here as an example. Say there's a player sitting in this car. Say this is not a trash car, but this is a real car, a Jeep. And there's a player sitting in the middle right here, and it's driving across from you. What's going to happen is naturally you're going to want to shoot like right at the window or maybe a little in front of it to lead the shot. But because of desync or maybe human error, um, this is not the proper distance right but the cheat knows the proper distance so you'll aim here and, and it and you actuate the cheat you just you hit the toggle and it'll kick your reticle out in front the proper distance fire the shot boom let go it'll go back to free he leads it again he misses toggles it pushes it out again and fires it it's so it's so obvious to someone who's seen cheats being used by testers um, almost every cheat really has this ability to, uh, and some are better than others. Some of the offset lang like, you know, your offsets, um, which are your settings for the game. When they do like little updates in the game, they change this, this language and then you have to go in and update it. And that's, that's why they have downtime. Um, and it's basically developer versus developer. You know, what did the game update? They have to change the offsets. These ones don't work too well. I'm missing a bunch of bullets. Um, you know, we need to update our offset language uh, inside the code or inside the cheat code so that we're a little more accurate because the locations where things are pulled aren't always as accurate. And sometimes that's how you get triggered for getting a cheat, which is why the cheaters, when, the, when there's an update in the game, they just don't use it. They'll go back to playing natural until they get that little text file and it just overwrites another one. And that's how fast it is to update your cheat. Um, it's really simple. And... Um, it just depends on the coder whether or not he's dedicated to getting the customers taken care of or not at speed at which it does. I know cheats that are updated in 30 minutes after an update. That's how fast they are. I mean, it can be, but some of them take up to six to seven to eight hours because they have jobs too that they, you know, so they're not right there at the computer waiting to friggin' update. They have to come home, update it, and then then launch it. So some, you know, some cheats get updated differently. You know what I mean? So um, let's go back to this and we'll take. Oh wait, hold on. You wanted to see this again. We we're gonna show the lead. Watch the lead. Now, watch where he goes. Watch where he aims. Initially, initially, it's right at the window. See, it's right at the window. 
It kicks it out. Kicks it out. Kicks it out. I'm a... Nothing you can do about it. It's doing a shot compensation. It's pretty obvious. Um, and then you, <laughs> and then we just look at this. I mean, I this is what I like to look at right here. That that shot right there was obvious in the in the Jeep. I've seen this a million times by testers. Uh, that's nothing new to me. This is. This was he didn't need to toggle here, but he did. It's so it's like he didn't need to, but he did anyways. That tells me what kind of person he is. It just lets me know who he is. You know, um, if I had a cheat running in a game, I wouldn't be toggling if I could kill these guys without, you know, any problem. I mean, does that does that look fucking natural to anybody here? Does that look natural to anybody? I don't think so. And the Jeep was even more blatant. Ladies and gentlemen, if you think that's legit, then either A, if you claim it's legit publicly and you actually voice your opinion and say this looks legit, either A, you have an agenda, um, B, you're uneducated in the way of cheats look and you just blindly believe everything is legit and nobody cheats or, uh, you know, or you're a cheater yourself and you're just here to throw mud and muddy the waters and cloud cloud the views of anybody else which is why I disable the chat because that that right there just is is toxic and lies and spewing lies I know it's real out there I work with battle eye I work with people that develop these sheets I work with people that test these sheets I've cracked numerous sheets I've had over 5500 individual accounts permanently banned because of the, my work with my team and that's just the last time I got an update on numbers they're still banning people off the work that I'm doing or I have done um, it's it's beyond me at this point because I can't get access to this sheet so I'm relying on the public to to uh, do what they think is best with regards to do you think CLG deserves to be in the pro league knowing what you know now do they deserve to be disqualified? Do you think any of the other CLG players possibly are in on it? Do you think they know? And if they do know, are they just as guilty as Doth PS? Now, I, I haven't dug into everybody. I don't have time to dig into everybody. What I would suggest is that everybody, everybody dig into these pro players. Start watching some of the clips they have. Start watching some of the things they do. And um, really scrutinize. Become critical thinkers in the community do not give people benefits of the doubt because that just perpetuates the problem and that's what cheaters want they want you to give them the benefit of the doubt like when a royalty member says he's trash at the game you forget to remember he's royalty he can't be trash at the game he's royalty Okay, he he has to have a level of skill at the game above everybody else who is struggling to get royalty. Do not let them socially confuse you when it comes to what's real and what is not. These are all smoke screens that cheaters use. Oh, I'm garbage at this game. Oh, I'm this. What what they do is, is they just don't toggle. They accept a shitty play and they and they get too tapped or they they purposely play crappy and look like they're trash followed up by man i'm garbage at this game um and it's just not reality because they can turn it on and they can turn it off whenever they want which means that nothing they say is valid it's just a smoke screen to confuse you the viewer i've been your host rick grimes i hope you found this enlightening as i did and uh saying the search for the truth continues be safe out there. Be careful who you sponsor and who you pay your money to. They could be cheating and liars. Take it easy, folks.